the shell, which is a um, homage to the famous shell builder Felix Candela, as the name also suggests, um, is about six by six meters uh, in plan, about four meters tall, and it has a surface area of uh, 50 square meters. It weighs five tons, and it was constructed using 30 kilos of a cable net that was tensioned into a rig, and 25 kilos of a knitted shuttering, so the knitted textile that went on top. So what is special about this, um, about this shell is not only the double curved geometry, but the fact that it's a waffle shell, meaning that it, it's a thin shell with stiffeners in two directions, with rib stiffeners in two directions, so you then have these cavities inside. To do this, to make this kind of shell, what we did was we built a frame, a timber and steel frame. We then tensioned a textile and cable net in that uh, timber frame. But what is interesting here is that you have the textile that has um, channels and pockets to guide the cable net on the one hand and some inflatables on the other hand. With the, that tensioned inside, we inflated these balloons that we had inserted into the textile. We coated it with a very special thin, fast setting cement paste. And then on top of that, cast concrete normally. So this is normal concrete casting. Once the concrete is hardened, you can remove the frame and deflate the balloons or wait for them to deflate. Um, and you're left with a structure that has cavities, making it a little bit more lightweight and a textile that is left in place. So this thing that you see here, this little blue line, is also what you see on the inside of the pavilion itself. Meaning that you have a textile that fulfills two functions this time. One is an aesthetic one and one is a technical one.